what is up guys it's soul bash and we finally have the update yes it has been out for two days already i'm sorry i'm behind but as you can see they have added different servers and different countries as well so some updates there and uh, let's see where do we want to start mm, you know what let's go with a new server and us diamond looks like it's going to be the one and there he is gunslinger spelled my name wrong thank you I have to spend diamonds on that later all right let's get right into it wait you know what let's skip the boring part let's get right into the fun stuff all right straight into the arena and let's go first time I'm ever doing arena on this character leveled up so far got me some wings for free I'll leave you the link for that video in the description below and we're just gonna go ham on this Fox mage not gonna try anything fancy but wait let's go drop this cunning leap and a smoke screen and let's juggle her until she is dead and this is a problem here. If you do not let them hit the ground, they will sometimes get stuck at one hit point. Just let them hit the ground, they will die. And let's do one more, maybe two more. And we have another gunslinger. Uh, do we need to go about this differently? Okay, drop the smoke screen juggling his pet not even touching him so let's move okay cutting leap smoke screen okay still focused on my pet that is great so that'll give me time to just work on the backside and take him down and uh, mr. Valentine it is over firm and you know what we'll do one more a lot of them I uh, did I mean a lot I believe I went all the way up to rank 100 and something so far on this server and here is a warrior he has more hit points uh, looks like he has higher level wings as well let's try out to avoid him but it doesn't look like it's going to happen he is quick he has the jumps and he can stay right on my tail and there's really not a whole lot that I am able to do about it and his pet is just right on me as well cunning leap no you know what that tells us guys that tells us we need to get some diamonds and we need to buy something but ooh, mega boss And this should be quite interesting, a level 19 popping in on the Mega Balls. It should be a quick split and a splat. Yes, probably. This guy, we have a level 10 in here with us. Okay, don't attack me. No, no. Up here. Stop. Up here. You want to hit this guy. Can we leave him hanging up there by himself? Ah, oh, he's gonna follow me back down. Okay, let's see if we can get at least get a couple hits in on him. Smoke screen. Yep. At least we did some damage to him. We'll get some rewards for that. That's cool. But what we really need is something to increase damage, help survivability. But I'm mainly wanting that damage. So. Yes, I did some more arenas without you guys seeing, and they added a nice get all button in the mail, and I'll grab those 1148 diamonds, and we can now go shopping. We are going to jump here into the store and check out what they have. Okay, they added the deep sea pack, Captain Sam pack, a gunlinger pack. I think they spelled that one wrong. Hades ring pack, okay. We have future pack, PvP, Dark Revere, and the usual deep sea outfit pack. All right, so we have four different choices. PV outfit pack, 500 damage, 2500 health. It's a lot of health, but it's not as much damage as the future. Okay, 
500 and 2500 on the reverie as well and I believe deep sea pack is the same exact stats yes it is okay so this is a conundrum we have four different packs all affordable but I like that damage more health I'm not too much worried about and it also comes with some extra goodies as well 350 damage on that one and hmm decisions decisions shall we go with hmm, PvP you know the PvP outfit does look pretty wicked though I mean look at that with the wings too but you know what ah uh, this is tough look at the guns okay those are pretty sick looking but gonna have to go uh, decisions uh, mm. you know what they added a confirm purchase button to that thank you for that I will take the future outfit and let's put this bad boy on I'm gonna go with high damage for this character because he is ranged let's go ahead and slap all this on and I'm pretty sure I don't have the extra soul stones to enchant anything right now but we will be doing that in a future video and we have everything home I'm level 19 at level 20 guilds unlocked so I will be creating a guild on this server this is diamond us 33 so guys if you have been longing for a way to be able to play with me I am going to be creating a guild and yes I will be taking applications for it be looking for people that are very into the game and willing to help out and let's actually jump into this right here which is a battlefield and he caught me off guard to begin with I was not expecting that okay let's get the jump on him getting back to range you can't see me Okay, Doc Holiday. Okay, we have a Platinum VIP in here already. This is going to be a cakewalk for us. Even though they do have a couple levels on us, I don't see them winning this one. Doing some pretty decent damage. And they just keep running. They see Doc Holiday, And they know it's not good. Okay, we see one down here. Where are you going, buddy? Get back. Smoke screen. Keep him from running. Slowing down. Get a good shot in. Oh, did I get him with it? I couldn't tell. Stop running! Oh, uh, come on. I think Doc's gonna get all of this as well. I mean, the mass amount of damage that he's doing, and booyah! Victory. Now, these little exclamation points, these are a new thing that they did add in. So, you can hit that, and it'll actually let you report the player for cheating. But guys, if you lose, don't get all butt hurt and press it and claim that they're cheating just because you lost. I mean, if you can tell that they're physically actually cheating and doing something wrong, yes, do it, but don't do it just because you lose. All right, let's try this, which is the demon realm, easy mode. Gonna be the first one I've ever run on this character and we're gonna see how it goes. We also have another fan with me. Uh, I believe that is Soul Kills. Uh, he is a super fan. He has been following me for quite a while now. And looks like he's going to be one of the first ones that do get into the guild when we create it. And I will be doing that tonight, guys. Actually, I need some recommendations on the names of a guild. So please leave them in the description. Not the description. I'll leave the description. You leave them in the comments and we will decide and pick and choose what we actually want to name the guild. Um, that and we also have a huge milestone coming up. Uh, we just hit 1500 this past weekend and 2000 is coming very, very fast. So for 2000 subscribers, I actually want to dub my subscribers with a name. So. We're gonna also be doing that event here over the next couple weeks, uh, naming our actual subscribers and followers. 
So guys, if you have any recommendations on those names as well, leave them in the comments below and I will create a poll, some form of fashion, some way, and we will decide on that. Okay, brace yourself. The big apes are coming. Big ape number one and two. And let's see if we can end this as quick as we can. And it is going pretty quick just to be some little noobs on a new server. And so far, guys, I have not been able to stop playing this character. It is extremely fun. And those died pretty quick. So you know what? I think we're going to test our abilities. I'm going to take myself and... Uh, May pick up soul kills and see if we can't do a hard mode on this. Should be very interesting. Flip a card. We got some blue boots. Okay, more fortification stuff. And let's go ahead and do that. And fortitude. Team instance. Demon realm hard and team Q. Invite soul kills. Already in a team. Okay, he hasn't left the other one yet. Give him a second. And has he left yet? Yes, he has. Jump right into it. This is going to get interesting. See who he throws in there with us. Okay, it throws at level 16. You're kidding me, right? Okay. Any day now. Here we go. This is about to get fun. Okay, these up here, I know quite a few is gonna spawn, so smoke screen them. And let's see what we can do. Juggle's quite good as far as normal mobs. I do like how he can uh, knock them down and juggle them around quite a bit. It makes tasks quite a bit easier. And let's see. Range stuff, it can get kind of annoying, especially on some bosses. Because I'm not quite putting out as much damage as I would like so far. Smoke screens, those are pretty nice. You see them dropping everywhere because it's nothing but gunslingers in here with us. And I expected that fully on a new server, especially on the release weekend of. A new expansion which is firestorm and how are we doing on teammates soul kills looks like he's still fairly good help and this other kid is that his name actually kid okay he did a cunning leap I can't see his name right this second kid Cisco looks like he's already lost quite a bit of help Trash killed. Hades doing mad work already. Guys, this is insane. Just the amount of stuff that is flying around with these three characters. And each of us only have one pet. Ah, uh, I cannot imagine getting into a 25 versus 25, which we will be getting into very, very soon. Also, in the next couple videos, I will be covering pretty much the entire update. You know, what came out, what's new, what's fresh, what we can look forward to. And here comes those big apes again. Except, this is now hard mode. So this is going to get very interesting. Okay, Soul Kills is already at half health, starting before the boss. Oh, and they have, they pack quite a punch, especially for this level. Which is fun because I have not done these in quite a while, especially with the low level character. You know, most of my low levels, I slog them in and do daily stuff. I don't really do team instances on them. Try to single them out. Really need to get them together. Uh, 
throwing snowballs. Okay. And Soul Kills. Oh, he's hurting. He's about to go down. Run. Drop that smoke screen. Slow him down a little bit. What I'm trying to do is trying to get him lined up. And looks like Soul Kill has bit the dust. In his commemoration, he was still standing. Even though he was dead, he was still standing. And it looks like it's down to me. We have Kid Cisco laying on the ground there. Soul Kill standing like a statue. Oh boy. This is gonna get interesting. Oh, all the knockdowns. Okay. Since it's just me, we are going to basically kite them and see how this fares. Okay, we got them both grouped together. Missed both of them with that floating shot. And I would have to say my only complaint so far about the gunslinger is that part right there where he splits his shots. You're unable to move while you're in that position. So you can get caught in some pretty nasty positions. And I have been caught in quite a few of them so far and either messed up a boss fight or got killed in PvP because of it. But that's going to come into not having to use autoplay and just adjusting to the playstyle of having a ranged character, which is very different than what I'm used to. I'm used to being in the middle of everything and just not caring about getting hit. Now I'm trying to kite as much as I can and still do my damage. But, oh, got me in the corner. Get out of there. And let's not get caught in that. And as you can see, the heal amount is pretty crazy. I have ascended the wings. We'll, we'll go over that and show you how to do that. But it looks like I am going to succeed. Let's get out of that. Yes! Got him with the smoke screen. All right, guys. This was extremely fun. I'm looking forward to a lot more on this uh, guy. And like I said, we're going to be creating the guild. So leave the comments below. And of course, as always, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.